Okay, I'm going to show you how to set up a new shapefile layer. Shapefiles are the lingua franca of vector GIS. They've been around for ages. They're a file format developed by Esri back in the day, and pretty much every GIS knows how to use them. I don't actually like them. I try not to use them very much, but they're pretty much well understood. So let's go into layer, new, new shapefile. Now, as we can see, shapefiles come in three different flavors. There's point, line, and polygon, each referring to the type of geometry that is going to be stored. So you can have point geometry, you know, distributions of observations within the landscape, line geometry, so to do with road networks, for example, uh, and polygon geometry, so uh, areas of water or uh, fields or houses, etc. And in this example, we'll create a line geometry. We need to specify the coordinate reference system. Uh, that should come in as default from what we set up earlier on, but for some reason hasn't. So we go into CRS system, choose the projection, click on OK, and we can add extra attributes if we so desire, such as observer, referring to the person who's taking an observation, that's obviously text. Um, and we can add that to the attribute list. We can add number of observations uh, and oh, let's remove that and number of bobs and we want that to be a whole number um, and that will be fine okay all right once we're happy with how we've set up the, the system click on OK and then we can give it an appropriate file name and put it in the appropriate environment and click on save and there we are we have our new line layer fantastic right i will see you at the digitizing video